Hi, I'm Felicity, and these are my friends, Taylor, Japri, Ileana, and Jack. All my friends have disabilities which make them just a little different than you and I, but despite their differences, they still can do and like to do many of the same things we do. Check out this video about Jack to learn more about him and why we shouldn't treat him or anyone else on the autism spectrum poorly. I am Tim and this is my son Jack. When he was about four years old, Jack was diagnosed on the autism spectrum, which can be a broad base of a whole bunch of different disabilities. He can have some delay with gross motor, he can have some speech delays, he can have some attention deficit delays, and has sometimes trouble sort of navigating the world as the way that a normal neurotypical person would. Jack has a very hard time sort of understanding what people are asking him. If somebody asks you how your day is, you, you say, fine, how was your day? That's a whole different brain pattern for Jack. How your day, well, how was your day? First of all, what are you asking me? Second of all, why do you, who are you and why do you care what my day was? Thirdly, how is my day? Now I have to think back to all this information. He's not trying to be mean to them. He just doesn't know in a lot of ways the appropriate way of responding. Jack really likes playing his video dance game uh, on the Wii. Do you like playing your dance game? Yeah, I do. You do? Do you like having friends play with your dance game? Yeah. Do you play dance game with Eli? Do you like going over to his house and playing dance game? Yeah, I play Dark Horse. You do? Eli likes Dark Horse. So the next time you see someone on the autism spectrum, remember to be a star.